Uh, this is Amanda with Chameleon Keto, and I wanted to just show you guys real quick one of my favorite, like all time ever Costco finds for keto um, meal prep. And so first, this is what I have in here is a, a mixture of eight ounces of cream cheese and a whole container of the two pound smoked, uh, smoked pork from Costco. Basically just have to let the cream cheese soften and heat it up in the microwave in like, I don't know, one minute bursts. Usually it takes about two minutes to get it easy to spread around. Um, so with this, you can make about 10 wraps, I believe. Um, at least that's what I calculated. Um, it's the first time I'm actually measuring because I want to give you guys a good idea of how far your money can go. I think this two pounds was $12 for the smoked pork, but unless you have a smoker, this, this is just so, so good. I mean, the flavor of the smoked pork, ugh, it's just so good. Um, zero grams of net carbs and the cream cheese, it does have like one gram of carbs or less than a gram of carbs per serving. So it's a really great keto meal. So I want to see how many, because this has 32 ounces and then we have three ounces per serving. So I just want to do a quick, see, that's 1.4. Okay, so that's about three ounces right there. And this is actually a really good amount to go inside of the wraps that we're gonna make today. So I'm gonna set this to the side. I'm gonna show you the wraps that I make. So right here, I also got these from Costco. Um, there's 14 of these egg wraps. They're made with cauliflower. And these are also going to be zero grams of net carbs or zero grams of total carbs, you know, net carbs, whatever. Um, and I just like, you can eat them cold or heat them up. And I like to heat mine up for about 10 seconds in the microwave just to make it easier to roll. So this is what the, the top looks like. It's very, very thin, but the texture you guys is so good. It's like eating a regular wrap. You don't feel like you're eating keto. It's almost like cheating. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna put three ounces in here. And the only thing I really added to the meat other than the cream cheese was a little bit of salt and pepper. And you can add whatever you want. You can add a hot sauce if you want to. Really, you can do whatever. Okay, I'm just gonna grab some lettuce. Where did it go? Just any old lettuce will do. This is what I'm using. First, I'm gonna add a little more cracked pepper. I'm a pepper fiend. a little thin layer of lettuce you can add more whatever will fit <laughs> and then I will show you guys how I roll it up so you want to be really careful because these can rip and you don't want that they're I mean they're pretty sturdy for how thin they are but you know and we're gonna go ahead and wrap it up like a little burrito my wrapping skills aren't perfect but there you go. There should be more coming out of the top here, but <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and take a bite. Mm. So good. So, <clears throat> One of these is gonna run you probably, I don't know, if we add up all the carbs, probably one, two, maybe two grams. 
if I'm correct. I would say three grams of carbs max, but I'm really pushing for two since this has pretty much zero. These wraps have zero. Your lettuce, hmm, probably zero, yeah. Well, this type of lettuce actually has three grams of carbs per serving, but a serving size is two cups, so really less than a gram per serving of carbs. So this is my delicious, super simple Costco meal. You can make a bunch. You can make at least 10 wraps, if not more, depending on how big or how thick you like them. You might be able to make up to 15 if you, if you make them like this. They're really filling. They're high fat. Um, I would say moderate protein and just absolutely delicious. There are a lot of ways you can make this. Um, you can add pretty much anything you want to to these wraps to bulk them up a little bit more. You could add avocado, um, pretty much, you know, onions, whatever. You could do it with a different type of meat. I just really like these wraps. They have such an amazing texture. It's not just like egg. Um, there's a, there's a bite to it, there's a chew to it. That's different from just egg because you have that cauliflower in there. But yeah, absolutely delicious. So if you guys are interested in more quick uh, recipes, go ahead and like, follow, subscribe, whatever you wanna do. Um, I am on Instagram under Chameleon Keto as well. So yeah, thank you so much for watching and you have a fantastic day. Bye.